Hi guys, I have braids in, which means I'm gonna have curly hair tonight. I'm gonna leave them in um, throughout the day. I am gonna go walking today. It is cheer day for Ashley. You guys, can we just take a minute to just, just be quiet. The kitchen is clean, which means the kids all did their chores. I have a whole load of dishwasher washing. I have a clean living room right here. It's not sunny outside, but it's not raining, so there's a plus. I've been working on the computer. Um, trying to find a chiropractor for Abby. She's done acupuncture and cupping, and I think we're gonna try um, a chiropractor. She's getting her headaches again. I thought that the it was kind of going away, but it's not. So, guess what I'm doing right now? It is time. It is time. Can you guess? Let me give you. Let me. Let's just see if you can guess. Yep, it is list time. I actually have done one list so far. Actually, have I done two? Two. Well, one of them was just like all of our, I can't show you, because it's all the um, reservations, the code numbers, the dates, um, of everything that we have already reserved. So I have one page with that, but I literally can't show you that page, because <laughs> that has way too many details ahead of time. Um, and I can't show you more than this side of the page right here. This is my to-do list of things to do leading up to our trip, but the other side has our schedule of everything that we are currently scheduled to do. Um, so we are going to start on a blank page because I am going to start my packing list. Um, I need to um, start packing. I have, I can't even say how many days or weeks or whatever until we go. Um, but it is time to start. I also have a whole bunch of boxes over there of things to film for a Hawaii video. I might actually film that tomorrow if I have time because um, it's just one of the videos that I can film. I can actually just like get it done, check it off my list, upload it, schedule it, um, and have it done. And that saves me right leading up to when we're gonna go on our trip. Um, and I will have makeup on tomorrow. <laughs> no, that sounds dumb, but I have a doctor appointment in the morning with Ashley, with her pediatrician, virtually, and then I have a scan um, to go to. So I will have makeup on. So I am going to probably do that video tomorrow if I have time. We'll see, we'll see how the day goes. But I am in full force of uh, making this little list. I am walking, watching The Blacklist on Netflix. I'm not even done with season one, and there's nine seasons, which is fantastic, because I just let it play as I work, and I don't necessarily have to follow along word for word looking at the screen. I can just listen. Um, and then I'm just kind of killing time here. Not killing time, I'm getting things done. Um, but Ashley has therapy, and then we're gonna leave early to go to her cheer so she can stretch. A bunch of the girls go after school, and they stretch, and they have a little snack there at the gym um, and I would like to start walking a little bit earlier because I have an activity tonight at church with the women and it's going to cut into two hours of my walking time. <laughs> I've been doing so good at it so Ashley's letting me go early to get some walking time in and then I will have to leave her there. Jason will hopefully meet me at the same time and he'll be able to either work out get a basketball or something or just hang out with her until she is done with her cheer and he'll bring her home. I will come home, get ready, and go to my activity. So that is kind of the plan for today. I'm trying not to go out and do anything because we will be going out with Ashley. I do have a list for the dollar store. I have all the gifts um, kind of all divvied out and inventoried for the, all the girls' birthdays as well. And I'm just gonna make it easy on myself and get gift bags for everything. I don't, I don't wanna bother with wrapping paper and wrapping. I'm just gonna put everything into gift bags. I just, I don't even care. The girls know that they're not getting a big balloon display this year. They're not gonna get the hoopla. I just don't have it in me and they don't necessarily care. We're just gonna have to like do things differently for Kay Kaylee's 18th birthday. Um, she wants something for her birthday in Hawaii. 
And so that's kind of her big thing. And so we're not doing a huge to do about her birthday here at home. Maybe what I'll do is I'll surprise her with a cake when we go to her boyfriend's house. We're gonna go play games with his family. Maybe I'll surprise her with a birthday cake to do there. I don't know. It's a little early for her birthday, but we'll see. Maybe maybe that would be a good idea. That's what we're doing today. I thought maybe it would be fun to take you on my little journey of making my lists. I don't know, it's kind of fun to me. I have these cute little stickers one of you sent me. Um, and they have puffies on them. And so I actually just take the puffy off because I don't want them to stick up in this notebook. Um, so I just, I actually, here, I'm going to show you really quick. So I have the, try and get it to focus. Focus. Okay. So I have that little thing and I actually have found the clippers. Peels it off super easy. So these are always here by my desk. Then I have a nice flat uh, little sticker, I guess. This has a little bump on it as well. I could take that off. I'll see how much that sticks up in my notebook. And then I just used double sided tape. I have to like hone this from every, I, had, I have to hide the double stick tape from everyone because it's not regular tape and I don't like to share it. <laughs> And then I double stick tape it like that. Next thing to decide is where to place it. I do have a strip of um, washi tape. Um, I haven't decided how far down it goes. So I just have it attached here. Kind of matches all the colors. So I could put it here. So I could put the sticker up here, but really my lists are going to be um, pretty big over here. Um, and I'm going to add lists on this side. So I think I'm going to go higher up. Normally I don't. Normally I kind of use up this space because I don't use this side as much. But I am this time. So I'm going to stick it right up here. It was not um, fitting. That was my vacation countdown. Literally can't show that to you. Well, let me show you the cute little picture. So I can show you that it's days. <laughs> Although it does days the whole time, even if it's weeks. It does show um, days. It can be 600 days and it'll still say days. So there's my cute little vacation countdown. I always use these. How many of you guys use these? Because, uh, you know, if, you, if you've if you gone on a trip to Hawaii, I guarantee you, you use this app. Because <laughs> we always count down the next time we can go back. Next is to decide if I'm going to put a sticker um, in this bottom corner. But again... I really want to utilize the full list, but I don't want it to be boring down here in the corner. So I might just do like a little teeny tiny um, plumeria right down there. Or I could do like a little leaf on that or tropical vibes and just put it right down here on the bottom. That might be kind of cute and that would match like this like situ situation up there. I don't know, but this is kind of what I try and decide. Usually I want to put something here and something up in the corner right there, um, but I really need to utilize this space because I'm actually gonna use this side of the notebook and make separate lists as well. I'll show you what they're gonna say here in just a second. Um, and sometimes I might actually use more washi tape in defining the list space on this side. I haven't done that before. But I'm trying to decide. Oh, I could do like a little uh, little pineapple. I could do a little pineapple and like a little bird. Or Oh, that would be cute. That little flower right there. I could use those two and like define the two lists that I'm putting on this side over here. That would be kind of cute. I could even run another strip down this side and then put those two next to it. That's kind of cute. Next, I have my little, can you even see that? I have my little stencil and I use the um, squares to make my little check boxes. Can you even see that? See how I, I used all that side? <laughs> and I just line it up with my little tape right there and I just start making 
boxes. For this one, I'm gonna make the boxes all the way down. I just have to choose a color. Usually I go with a different color than the actual tape itself. So I've got a green one that'll look kinda cute. Um, and then, where I should use this color green? I don't know. So there's a, this one matches the Hawaii. Maybe I should go with like green because that's what's down here. So this is my thought process. Um, I only have like this color green. I don't know if I like that one. So I will put the little boxes all the way down. There is going to be two separate lists on this side. It's going to be electronics and I can't remember. <laughs> I could look at my, my other lists. Hang on. See, these are previous um, pages that I have done for past trips. See, yeah, I do it like, um, I do my list for my clothes and then I do electronics, but usually I do electronics over on this side. Um, this is all water gear and then um, a kid's packing list. I will do a kid's packing list separate because um, they, I just do a separate page all together. Um, and then I write lists of things that I need to remember um, to put into their bags as well um, but that's why I just do electronics and water so let's see here I have probably water will start and do a bigger list here and then I'll do electronic down here and I didn't stick these on super tight so if I want to move this little decal to really start where the electronics is I can but it doesn't really matter um, so this side is mainly just going to be all of the things that I need to take. I don't make a list for Jason. He's on his own. <laughs> the water list that I will make will include his snorkel gear and the beach gear and stuff. So he has it way easy. He just has to remember to pack his clothes. Okay, it's all done. I know I could probably create like an Excel file and have this done. <laughs> like I wouldn't have to rewrite it every single time and I could just check off the list. But this is like way more fun. And, you know, maybe it changes every time, maybe it doesn't. But I just enjoy doing it, and I enjoy checking things off of a list. I've got packing items here, like my clothes and all that kind of stuff. And then I've got bathroom items right here, including medicines and, and lotions and things like that. And then I've got water supplies, face masks, goggles, pool toys, towels, and then all of our bags. <laughs> we have to take a lot of bags. Um, cooler bags and Costco bags and beach bags. It's just, it's a lot easier if you have stuff to put it in. <laughs> and then this little section here is my electronics. Actually, I just remembered one more thing. Um, I'm going to add my little travel bag to this list. This bag right there, which actually secretly between you guys um, and I, there's a battery died. Sorry. <laughs> Go ahead and charge this guy. But I do have a birthday present hiding in there. So don't let me forget that. <laughs> um, I can't show it to you because it's not a birthday yet by the time this video goes out. So that's going to charge. But anyway, my list is all done. The electronic list will likely get um, larger um, as I think of things that need to go into this bag. Um, and like I said, there's a birthday present in there. Right now, I don't think it has anything in it. Maybe there's leftover stuff. Um, but most likely it's just empty. So I had fun making my official list for our trip. It helps me like work through my brain and like things that need to get done. Um, so that it just helps me a lot. So I'll put away my washi tape. It goes down here in my little cubicle down there. And my stickers, if I can get that to snap on. We'll put that away. Oh, put this away right there. This whole thing, <laughs> something just fell off down there. I gotta shove it and make it like stand up taller. All right, put that all back together. Got my little list. Oh, this is the dress I got for Kaylee. Um, technically for her birthday, but it would it was gonna be the dress she was gonna wear for our family photos. Um, it's really cute little sundress. She is getting her senior portraits taken as well. It might be the one we use on her like announcement card or whatever we mail out if I end up doing that. But it didn't fit her. 
<laughs> so I just ordered another one on Amazon. This one came from Shein and I had a whole bunch of other things that I ordered. But since I am not putting another Shein order and I don't pay for sh shipping on Shein, <laughs> I, I save everything until it's a large enough order to get free shipping. Maybe they have free shipping right now, but it takes a long time to get things from Shein. So we just ordered something on Amazon. The style of dress is very similar to that one. It just has little black polka dots on it. But um, I have Ashley's appointment in one hour. You guys, look how well this works. Look, I am more prone to coming to the fridge and getting a healthy snack by having my veggies all ready to go. Um, yes, I am a creature of habit. I have the same thing um, because if it's easy, then I will do it. And so I'm gonna make healthier choices if I make it easier for myself. So last night when I got home from taking Chelsea to the church, um, I just quickly grabbed my broccoli that I had already cooked, had that and a little cheese hot dog and called it good for dinner. You know, it was just easy. So what else am I gonna have? I really wanna have some pineapple or something. Maybe I'll cut this pineapple. Let's see if this is ripe. I don't know if it is or not. It's not looking so yellow except on that one side. Maybe I need to turn this guy upside down and ripen it up. So maybe I'll cut that off. So I won't have any fruit for today, which is unfortunate, but I will have some veggies and some cottage cheese. You guys, these little cucumbers from Costco, they're different than um, ones we've had in the past. These ones are really small, um, but they're really good and they're really crunchy. Um, and they're saving really well in those jars. So, um, also, I don't know anyone. <laughs> this is gone. Why do you put a used, like an open Coke or an open soda in the fridge? It's gonna lose all of its carbonation. All of it. There's no point. <laughs> um, I also washed out my water bottle that I got. Little stinker Ashley. I had to hide the other ones that she's getting for her birthday. She doesn't know where I've hidden them, but we are going to take this to the gym tonight. Um, and both of us will use it and see how it works. And um, I just got it all cleaned out from sitting in the store and having everyone put their dirty mitts on it. Um, but I'm going to hurry and eat because as soon as we get to this appointment time, we're going to kind of have to be off and rolling and going faster for the day. So Time to be eating healthy for right now because later on it, there's only going to be time for snacks. There might be mild food at my event tonight, but I need to eat a healthier meal for right now. Also choosing bright food is very appealing as well. <laughs> if you have different colors on your plate, it's likely that it's very healthy. So doesn't that look really good? I have a nugget here ready for cheer, Try correct? Try and do a handstand. Do it that way, but yeah. <laughs> Got our stuff ready to go and a water bottle. So I'm going to change into shorts. It's been cold, so I'm, I've kept my sweatpants on as long as possible. You ready to go? Did you have mascara on your eyes? No. Why are your eyes black? I don't know. <laughs> Gosh, your face. I don't know why you had mascara on, but you can play with it if you want. I did. All right, we just went to the dollar store on our way here, and I got some lip gloss I'm gonna show you. Um, and then we are just doing basic. I might have some bags to go with these at home, and I might add some color to them, but we're we're gonna go basic for your birthday bags, right? No surprise. Not, well, I'm just trying to make it easy on myself. All right, so this is the little lip gloss that we got, and the brand is Be Pure. And yes, Ashley, I did find this from TikTok, but like it's clear, like the stick itself is clear, or white, I guess. But then when you put it on, it color changes based on the pH of your skin. So I have put it on my hand. <laughs> Check that out. It goes on clear. Maybe I can have Ashley, will you hold the camera and I'll show them how I put it on? All right, so you can see here, I'll look, roll it up. It's clear. It's just like clear. It looks blue on camera. Okay, and then I'm going to rub it on just one time. You can already see it doing it. Can you see it, Ashley? 
On camera? Yeah. I it's can very see it. chunky. What do you mean, chunky? Like, on camera, you can see all the chunks. <laughs> My hand, yes. Yeah, those are called wrinkles <laughs> and veins, you little twit. No, like... Whatever. But, it's crazy. Alright, so uh, I... Ashley! Oh my goodness sake. Uh, <sighs> you thought having me girls would be... <laughs> no, <laughs> between you and Dad's bad gas, I don't even know what to do with myself. <laughs> you so I'm a little embarrassed about how fuzzy my hair is with the braids, but I really want them to be curly tonight for my activity. So I'm just gonna be okay and a little embarrassed about having my hair this way. Um, I was going to have a friend to come down and join me, but she isn't feeling well today. So we'll just, we'll walk on our own for a little bit. And, um, until, until it's Abby. Oh, Abby is also walking over here from school. She has to go and film or take photos of the tennis game. Um, and so then she needed a ride home. And I was like, yeah, when I'm done walking. So she'll come and get the key for me. She'll probably just sit in the car here. Um, she might even walk over to the dollar store because it's right here next to it. So you'll see Abby. Well, she doesn't like to be on camera, so she, you won't see her. You'll see a little, <laughs> a little bit of her. Um, a glip. And then she'll just hang out until I'm ready to go home. You ready to go in? Yes. And just like that, I'm ready. Showered. Look at this hair. Oh, I love it so much. I love it so much. I just decided I'm going to do it this way. For our family photos in Hawaii. I'm very excited. I just need to get Ashley to braid my hair the night before <laughs> our photos. I think we have a luau the night before. So I might do, I might just do braids for the luau because it'll be kind of hot. I don't know, but we're gonna try this lipstick because look, I have showered. I have scrubbed at this. I cannot get this off. Abby used it in the car um, and her lips are like, pink so let's see what they do to mine i'm gonna have to use the mirror here instead of with you guys so hang on can you see it though it's a lot more pink on camera i will say that but it is getting more pink <laughs> in person. I do like that once it's on and kind of dried on, um, it's on. I think I put a little too much, um, whatever you call it on. I didn't put foundation on, so I just put a little bit of my contour on. But I, I don't know, I like it. Um, I am ready early. Let's see what time is it. Yes, I can actually just go re relax for a minute, check in with Chelsea. Um, Jason's on his way, well, he's not on his way home. He's on his way to Ashley. Um, and he's gonna try and work out. Okay. I just, I am like 40 minutes ahead of time, which is quite nice. And it feels nice to be, kind of be done up. I'm wearing this new shirt that I got. Where did I get this? Do you guys remember? <laughs> if someone remembers, let me know. Because I don't remember where I got it from. I'm really baffled. Maybe old maybe? I could look at the tag, but. I just got done with my little activity. I don't know if I really fully explained it. It's our um, women's group at um, church. It's called a Relief Society, if you want to know what it's called. Um, but it's our 181st birthday as an organization. And so we had a birthday party around the world. And people brought decorations um, that they've collected as they lived in different places um, all over the world. And as we went and kind of rotated between all the different tables the person who had lived in that place or had you know visited that place um, got to tell us 
stories of either going to church there or just their experiences living in that country. So someone was from um, New Zealand. Her husband is from New Zealand and they have since visited many times. And um, anyway, got to learn a little bit more about their culture and then Mexico and Canada and I didn't make it to all the tables. <laughs> um, so it was really fun to like, um, just kind of talk about different cultures and different um, areas of the world. Um, oh, someone else um, has Samoan um, heritage. And so we, um, got to see some of her Samoan belongings and things that she has collected from her ancestors and people who still live um, in Samoa. She's kind of visited and whatnot, but it was really fun. And I'm going to go home and <laughs> crash and um, probably watch a show. But I appreciate you coming along my little journey today. Um, I'm sure Jason is home tired after getting Ashley from cheer and doing a workout himself. So I'm just going to keep the camera put it away and we'll catch up with you um next time um I don't know if Jason's gonna go skiing I we're worried that we're on the last couple weekends of him being able to go skiing but he's finally figured out how to use his camera and get the good angles and he's like it's gonna be over before I even like get good footage I mean he's gotten good footage but he's finally figured it out and um we broke one of our GoPros last week and so he's like oh, I gotta make this one useful so I don't know if he'll be around, but you might get one more little ski little snippet from him. Um, but one of these days I might put up a video of a compilation of all of their skiing adventures that him and his brother this year, um, it's just kind of like a little, um, Warren Miller ski video. If you've ever watched those, um, I've already started it and it has kind of funky music and it's just more a gift to him and his brother to like remember that they're they spent so much time together this season when they've both been busy as business owners and they haven't necessarily had time to um go in and, and find their hobbies and they both kind of have some time too and I just want them to be able to remember that so I'm going to give that video to them as soon as they're done skiing for the season um because it's been really fun for them but anyway sidetracked I'm already thinking of Friday. <laughs> but take care and we will see you guys next time. Good night. <laughs>